This video describes the solid mill facing improvements now available in Esprit. To optimize control of the cutting position and facing operations, Esprit introduces a new step over mode, even mode. This ensures proper cutting action throughout the operation, prevents air cutting, especially on last passes, and improves overall pass distribution. Esprit now also supports roll-in approaches, maintaining the proper cutting action on entry. Therefore, a smooth entry into the material, good surface finish, and part quality are ensured. To get started, we program two facing operations with a climb milling strategy to machine a stamping die. The tool approach into the material is very important to ensure a good surface finish and optimal tool life. Everything starts with chip formation. The cutter position forms the chip. In this simulation, we have a total engagement of the cutting tool generating a thin to thick to thin chip. This is not a good situation as the cutter rubs rather than shears the material on entry. This causes the inserts to slam up against the material. What we want is a thick chip as we enter and a thin chip as we exit. To ensure this proper cutting action, we set the step over parameter in the operation strategy tab to shift the position of the tool. In this scenario, the tool is 50% engaged. We have a thick chip on entry, then a thin chip on exit. However, this situation is still not ideal. The center of the tool is positioned right on the boundary, resulting in a very unstable cutting condition, which we want to avoid. So we set the step over to 70% and have an overhang of 30% to ensure the proper cutting action as well as the cutting condition. Having a step over of 30% and 70% overhang is also okay, we just want to avoid the 50-50 scenario. In case of multiple passes, how do we ensure the same control of the tool position throughout the operation? Esprit solves this with a step over mode, which not only helps with controlling the initial positioning against the stock, but also the subsequent and final passes. There are two step over modes available, constant and even. We have defined a step over of 70% and an overhang of 30%. Thus, the cutter is positioned so that its engagement in material ensures the correct cutting action and condition during the initial pass. Constant step over mode applies the specified step over throughout the passes and calculates the last pass to clear remaining material based on the cutting area defined by overhang direction and percentage. So we ensure that our tool stays engaged by 70% until the last pass. However, this constant step over mode causes the last pass to be smaller than previous passes, and several times the last pass does not cut anything, as we can see here. To solve this, Esprit offers a second step over mode, even step over. This mode calculates step over such that each pass provides the same engagement, keeping the step over equal to or less than the specified step over. This provides better pass distribution and prevents air cutting, resulting in increased productivity. Note that the behavior changes when we use the zigzag milling strategy, specifically the cutter position and transition movements between passes. When the bridge movement is set to segments, the segments allowing the transitions are shifted accordingly to the overhang percentage value here, the tool correctly overhangs by 30% and engages by 70% during the transition movement. When bridge movement is set to arcs, it is the high point of the arc which drives abiding by the overhang value. In some cases, depending on the cutting diameter, material may be left behind, so some adjustments may be required. Going back to a climb milling strategy, notice that the lead-in of each pass is straight, generating a thick chip as we exit the cut of the first shears. This produces a poor finish and increases strain on the tool on each pass entry. Machine operators end up reducing feed rates, leading to lost productivity. That's why Esprit now supports roll-in approaches. With the roll-in technique, we focus on easing the inserts into the cut, ensuring a thick chip on entry and a thin chip on exit. We just need to make sure that we are rolling in the right direction. If we use the climb strategy, the tool must turn clockwise. If we use the conventional strategy, the tool must turn counterclockwise. To summarize, the roll-in technique achieves a thick chip on entry and a thin chip on exit, as does the control of the cut position throughout the operation with the step-over mode. The new even step-over mode improves pass distribution and prevents air cutting. As a result, you get good surface finishes and good part quality, as well as increased tool life and productivity. Thank you for watching this Esprit product feature video. For more information about this and other new features in Esprit, refer to the Release Bulletin and Product Help.